The Buddha told us that we should do our best not to hurt people. We should do our very best not to, to harm others with our body, not to say things that hurt people's feelings, not to think bad thoughts like bad wishes or bad aspirations for other people's failure and things like that. But, and that, that at least if we change this, then we won't create the causes that produce suffering. It means when you don't hurt someone, you don't create the causes that would one day be experienced as being hurt. So what the Buddha is basically saying is that whatever we do happens to us. Majina. Whatever you do happens to you. Now that's not bad if what you're doing is, is good, fine, kind, lovely, generous, uh, wonderful things because then equal in that way, good, fine, lovely, wonderful, prosperity and fortune would result for you. And the Buddha said, yes, do as much good as you can. So even from a selfish place, if you if you just think for yourself, you would think, okay, I need to not be a bad, I, not, I need to not harm people. I need to help people because then that is going to help me. Our problem is that we're very reactive. We're reactive. So even though we know we shouldn't be harmful, you know, like, smashing and kicking people's mirrors when we go by their car in our motorcycle. We know we shouldn't be doing that. Still, it's just too irresistible. Just kick that mirror, <laughs> tell you a thing or two. And we, it's just very hard for us because our habit patterns are really um, overwhelmed with our previous actions. So if we've been harmful, we tend to continue to be harmful. If we've been aggressive, we tend to continue to be aggressive. In that we have created a habit pattern of being aggressive, we continue to do that. Nothing changes it. So how we have been is how we continue to be, unless we make a change. <laughs> 